Hey guys, today we get to see the entire Dominaria set was just leaked. What the blank is going on with Wizards of the Coast? Of course, they're going to probably blame some judge because why not run them over the ice cream truck? But we had Ixlon. We had the entire mythics and rares of Ixlon leaked. We had Commander 2017 leaked. And now we have a whole set. What the? Crazy. Crazy. And let's read this. As many of you know, there's a document going around with the Chinese Domania release notes. As you can imagine, this caught the attention of the community and has been rapidly translated. It's true, it's real, and it sucks this information got out earlier than we intended. In this case, we messed up and inadvertently let out let this out the door. It's not ideal, but we're going to make the best of it by trying a few new things to make sure that you still get a fun and exciting look at it. The whole document is here, by the way. You can go to the website. I will have a link. I'm actually going to pretty much copy and paste this onto my website to serve as a proxy. Right now, this is pretty ridiculous that they would actually... I don't know why they did this. So if you are interested in knowing what the cards are, you just keep going down. Here's the mechanics. Oh, here are the creatures. Uh, check lands. We get some check lands. We know what lands. Here are some card specific with the title. See, the only thing we're missing is the image. That's it. Look at how long that this dot blink of an eye, Chainer's Torment, Charge, Creature Ooze, Wand, some type of spear. I'm not going to read you all this because it's literally the entire set. Now, there's no one to blame but themselves. This keeps happening. So maybe if it happened one time, okay, great. It was a rogue employee. The fact that this happens pretty much every single set. Let's talk about Ixlon. It happened Ixlon. Let's talk about the Commander 2017 where a random dude, a random dude just so happened to have all the decks on hand. How is Ivra Halasan Witness? Pretty cool avatar. I'm glad to see avatars are back. Fight with fly. Okay, where's where's the planeswalkers in this? Planeswalker. Okay, here is a planeswalker. Last ability of Fire Sung and Sun Speaker can't target a planeswalker. Planeswalker. Is this a planeswalker? No. Some type of goblin. Uh, Inferno, Legendary, that's a Planeswalker. How many pages is this? Like, wow, this is a long... Oh, here's a Planeswalker. No, that's a Legendary Dragon with Kicker. So I will have this entire thing on my website in the link below uh, for you guys to look at. This begs the question of how does this keep happening over and over again? And of course, of course, Wizard Coast didn't do anything wrong. I like the fact that this is being leaked. Um, here's a pace bin. So what's the planeswalkers in this set? The empty one, that's a legendary creature. Oh, Gerard is back, that's pretty cool. It's an enchantment. Uh, tug off, famine, incarcerated, legendary. Oh, lots of avatars, lots of avatars. Legendary Tiana. Angel, oh, this is going to be a good one. Angel Artifact, sure. Oh, we have Foreign Elemental, classic. Oh, what's this one do? Flying, first strike for five. Whenever a Aurora or equipment you control is put in a graveyard from a battlefield, you may return it to its owner's hand, beating. Oh, it's just so so. Oh, this dude's back, Umazara. Last time we saw him was in Kamigawa. One free, creatures you control, power, toughness, one can't, or less, can't be blocked. Uh, I guess, it's okay. 
Oh, nice. We have this bird creature. The bird clerk is back. We have some more dinosaurs. Uh, we have triple blue gin. Oh, here, Tefe. So this is a planeswalker. Free double, free white blue, four plus one draw a card at the beginning of the next end step on top two lands for a counter spell, of course. Minus free, put target non land permanent into its owner's library, third from the top. Minus eight, you get an emblem with whenever you draw a card, exile a target permanent on an opponent, an opponent controls. Pretty cool. This is actually also tells you how to play the card. I wonder, like, why don't we see this normally? Ooh, Elf Knight. That's pretty good. 5-4. Oh, squeeze back. One double red legendary creature goblin. 2-1. You may cast Squeeze the Immortal from your graveyard or from exile. Pretty cool. That's a good one. Classic Squee. Skizrek. So, right, that's a reprint. So, they're reprinting. Oh, Seeds Gang Commander. So, goblins are in. Lots of reprints. Oh, here we have uh, Shauna Sisei's Legacy, or Child, pretty much. Green and a white, legendary creature, human warrior. It can't be the target of abilities your opponent controls. It gets plus one, plus one for each creature you control. Hmm. That's pretty good. Sentinel. Okay, so we got some more merfolks. Oh, what's this? Rona Discipline of Gix. Ooh, it's been a while since we did talked about Gix. One, a black and a blue legendary creature. Two, two, whenever it enters the battlefield, you may exile target historical card from your graveyard. Hmm, historical card. Rat Colony, we got some more. Ooh, legendary sorcery, though. That's pretty cool. Uh, you can only cast it if you have a legendary creature or planeswalker. Return all legendary permanent cards from your graveyard to the battlefield. Pretty cool. Cost seven though, that's a lot. I'm pretty sure I saw a, a mox. Oh, here's Oath of Teferi joining the plane chasers. Oh, Narao Niha, Miha. Anyway, there's too much to go through. Oh, this one's, this, wow, this, like everything is legendary in the set, jeez. Like, is there anything that's not? Oh, Mox Amber, legendary artifact. Act, add one mana of any color among legendary creatures and planeswalkers you control. That's going to be very good. Whenever I see that word Mox, it's always had value. Oh, here's the self. Mirage. Okay. Enough of that. The Nurturer. Oh, darn. Dawnbringer. What was the original? Rare Dawnbringer was a, such a beautiful card. Here we get like an upgrade. This upgrade is ridiculous. Five for a 5-5 five, five flying first strike lifelink. Other angels you control get plus one, plus one, and lifelink. It's an angel lord. It's like a bane slayer angel lord. Oh, we get a bunch of... Pretty much, okay, from what I can tell, it looks like literally everything in the set is a legendary creature, enchantment, or sorcery. So maybe speculate on legendaries. I'm glad this came out. Uh, obviously, people will have different opinions of it. Ooh, Khan, Scion of Urza for four. Legendary Planeswalker, Khan. Five. Plus one, reveal the top card of your library. An opponent chooses one of them. Put that card into your hand and then exile the other with a silver counter on it. Minus one, put a card you own with a silver counter on it from exile into your hand. Minus two, create a zero zero colorless construct artifact token with this creature gets plus one plus one for each artifact you control. This is pretty good. Um, you're going to get card advantage. You even get card selection. And you can eventually beat down if you're a dude. Ooh, legendary sorcery again. Oh, Juggernaut is back. So many interesting cards in the set. Oh, oh, this is a different one. Wow, so another legendary planeswalker. Jayard Ballard. Two double red, or triple red. Five for a five loyalty. Plus one, add triple red. Spend this mana only to cast instant or sorcery spells. Plus one, discard up to three cards and draw that many cards. 
That's pretty interesting. That's very good with madness abilities. Minus eight, you get an emblem. You may cast instant and sorcery cards from your graveyard. If a card cast this way would be put into your graveyard, exile it instead. I like it. It's mana acceleration like crazy. Uh, and then it's card, card draw, like card selection. Pretty good. What else are we missing here in Bolas? So Bolas is back. Ice Lean Manipulator. That's nice to see that one. Helm of the Host. They literally leaked literally every single card that's been leaked. I'm sure. They, oh, Ape Warrior. That's pretty cool. Grand Warlord Radha. Oh, Radha's back. When did we see her last? Was it Planar Chaos? Oh, Goblin War Chief. That is one of the best goblins in the history of magic. So I'm glad to see that the goblins are coming back with a vengeance. Gone on the Blood Flame. I don't remember this creature. I think it's new. Oh, Gaia's Blessing. One of the most beautiful cards in magic. Hopefully they keep the same artwork. Fire Song and Speaker, Legendary Creature Minotaur. Oh, everyone get out your dingaroos because it's time for a spike. Fight with Fire. Oh, the kicker. Mm, the Eldest Reborn. Very good card. So anyway, I'm going to have this thing pasted on the, my website just in case that it gets taken down. Uh, I think it's very interesting. They would actually surprisingly publish it all because I feel like they could have done damage control but they gave up on it uh, it won't stop here we're going to celebrate by giving you podcasts you have never want you don't want to listen to now because you already have all your cards spoiled they for the content creators who do get these really cool oh legendary creature human knight hmm it's pretty cool yeah, literally everything in this set is like legendary. Like, is there anything that's not legendary? As I scroll, they they list. Oh, isolated chapel is back. Mm, enemy colored dual lands. So these were first printed in Innistrad set. They pretty much disclosed everything in this set. Holy blank! Somebody made a mistake. Of course, that person is not going to get fired. They're going to get raised, and they're going to blame it on some judge's private group which may or may not also have funny Pepe memes. <laughs> How, Wizards of Coast? Come on, like, one time, maybe, two times, eh. The entire release notes with every single card. Ixlon. Do, does anyone remember Ixlon? This ha happened before our Devastation cards were spoiled. The entire Ixlon was spoiled. It rares and mythics. Now, are you telling telling me before Masters twenty five, the entire Dominia has been spoiled? What is going on? This is the biggest leak in Magic history, bar none, because somehow they felt like it would be a good idea to release it all. In the past, they've hide, they've tried to hide and blame and do all that type of stuff. But now it seems like they've given up, which is probably the right solution. But it doesn't solve the problem that leaks are happening. Like they don't tell us how the leak happened, do they? No, they're just super excited that it happened. <laughs> it's super excited. All right, great. So I guess they wanted it to leak. Fantastic. Anyway, bye guys.